Hello and welcome to Tram Sim, the tram simulator. Today we are back in Vienna and we're going to be doing the route 1 through to Prata. Um, what's it called? Completely forgotten. Prata Haupt Ali. There we go. So we're down at Stefan Verdingerplatz, if that's how it's pronounced. And we're kind of on the, the layover bay, uh, ready to pick up. Our adoring public round there, all wearing their masks and uh, all wearing the same outfit by the looks of things. The two in the purple on the right there. They've all got the same scarf on, the same hairstyle on, the same mask. What are the chances? Uh, there we go. Rightio, so I'm Joe and uh, fingers crossed it'll be a fairly seamless journey. Uh, we'll have a nice run down. I do think about liking the video, if you like the video that would be nice and of course do subscribe so that you never miss out on any of uh, the content that I produce. Uh, so just looking at the time, I think that's, where are we, we're at Stefan Verdingerplatz 13.11, that's about right looking at the time now, uh, so it's roughly a 43 minute journey just looking at that excellent rightio and um, what's the time now 13 we'll pop it to 13.9 give us a couple of minutes uh, so on this uh, I have just discovered that you can in fact use the joystick as a controller uh, so I'm using a Logitech joystick uh, I've put a link in the description I can't remember what it's called it's just a Logitech joystick. It's a fairly basic one, but uh, it seems to do the job. There we go, so everybody's on. And uh, just having a look. We're not due out for another two minutes. That's uh, okie dokie. That's enough time, so we'll watch them all getting on. It's a shame CCTV cameras don't go around corners, really, isn't it? Uh, so, yeah, also doing a bit of reading. Um, I don't, I've not been able to see any speed limits on this game. I've been up and down and up and down and I've not seen any speed limits, which I thought was a little odd. Um, but the general rule of thumb seems to be, if you're going around a tight corner, uh, which is quite a subjective statement, but a tight corner, you should go around it no faster than 15 kilometers an hour. If you're going over points or crossings, uh, you shouldn't go any faster than 25 kilometers an hour and uh, and everything else just seems to be a, a, a bit of a like free-for-all you can just kind of do what speed you want and if you go faster than 50 kilometers an hour on our little uh, speedometer here uh, it will be green all the way around and then it'll go red past here so I'm assuming that the tram speed limit is 50 kilometers an hour so uh, half a minute until departure time so uh, we'll get shut in the doors. There we go, doors shut, and off we go. So I, I will class this as quite a tight corner. So we won't go any faster uh, than 15 round here. And uh, I do actually owe the developers an apology. Uh, I did put it in the comment of my first looks video but uh, yeah, I was uh, like, hang on, there's no AI trams on here. It turns out there is, and I was just in the wrong mode. So hopefully, I believe we've got it set up in the right mode today. Uh, we will actually see other trams. Fingers crossed, anyway. Looking for that yellow dot, that's about right. Ten points, that's what we like. And uh, I don't believe that we've got any... Uh... Right, it's time to go now, come on, door shut. I don't think we've got any signals at this point, so we'll just... Uh... Let's have a look in the CCTV camera. Are you not stopping for us? No, it doesn't appear so. Aha, there we go. Colleague. Hello. Oh, that seems to be a little bit of lag. I didn't seem to experience this last time. Maybe this is just uh, 
just because we're recording, uh, the computer doesn't like it. And, uh, and these guys just seem to just pull out on you. And in true OMSI fashion. Andere brauchen ihren Sitzplatz vielleicht notwendiger. In true OMSI fashion, uh, if you, they'll stop like that, and then if you start accelerating, so will they. And uh, it is actually possible to crash into uh, AI traffic on this game because uh, I drove full pelt at a Mercedes. I thought, we'll give it a go, see if uh, it'll let us crash. And uh, it does. And it goes on your permanent record, which is, uh, that's nice, isn't it? Another 10 points. I've really got the. Uh, the stopping on this game down to an absolute T. Oh, are we getting on? What's what's going on here, chaps? Nope. Oh, yeah, just wait until I close the doors. I don't quite know what the protocol is either for uh, ringing the bell and indicating. Um, again, just reading online. Uh, on some of the comments, the indicating you only have to do when you're actually on the roads with other traffic. Uh, in terms of the bell, I tend. Whoa, look at that! I'm sure you were meant to stop there, mate. I tend to ring the the bell before we cross over with any road, uh, just to let any traffic know that we are in fact. Whoa! Thank you very much, sir. Just to let them know that we're here. And uh, I can't see any signals at this point, so I'm assuming that we are... Off we go. Work quick, quick, quick. Through the lights. I've got a timetable to keep to here. We can get past that. Give him a fright. Uh, yeah, we're sticking to the traffic lights here because I couldn't see any signals. Uh, we're back on signals here. And uh, so just looking at the signaling system here, the, that means to go, and I'm assuming that line means that we're off to the left rather than the right. I mean, the, the left in this instance happens to be straight on. Uh, so we're minus one. We are actually a minute ahead. So uh, that'll be my ridiculous fast driving, so we're not going to make this set of lights. Uh, yeah. So I mean, I know that in the last game I was quite heavily critical of, uh, of Tram Sim. Well, not really heavily critical. Um, more, it wasn't good value for money, £31.59. Mm, yeah, not, not happy with that. It turns out um, I found that if you actually look on CD keys, which I posted a link to that in the description. You can actually pick this game up for eighteen ninety nine, and now CD Keys is a perfectly legitimate... Oh, hang on, let's go. Lights are on. We're leaving half a minute early, but that doesn't matter. Uh, yeah, CD Keys, perfectly legitimate website, and uh, they just give you a Steam code, which you then activate through Steam. Awesome, right? So yeah, you can actually pick this up for £18.99. And uh, when you've only paid 18.99, it's a lot better. It, you, you feel a little bit less robbed. Uh, so yeah, definitely, definitely recommend it if you're paying 18.99. Still only one tram and one route, but fingers crossed, from what I was reading on their website, it looks like they're going to do more with this, which is good. So uh, my understanding, we don't need to indicate when we're down here. We just need to follow the signals, so uh, obviously green, and we're heading to the right. Jolly good. That's what we like. But again, we're early. Sorry, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll stop driving so fast. So, uh, obviously we've got some points. We'll be going no faster than 25 kilometres an hour over here. And uh, this looks like a sharp bend, so 15 kilometres round the bend. Right, I've had enough now, let's go. Everybody's aboard anyway. I mean, the trams are every like 
eight minutes or so through the day, so it's not long to wait for another, is it? And I reckon the back end's round now. I do quite like this little underground section, I think it's absolutely brilliant. Um, I can't help but thinking that the Manchester Metrolink would be significantly better if we had little underground sections like this in the city centre. You know, so that they weren't just trundling round, they could have a high speed bit. I say high speed, 50 kilometres an hour, wow! But yeah, they could have a, a bit like this under the city centre. I can't help but thinking you get about a lot quicker. So right, we're off to the left here this time. I'm loving the echo when you're underground. The uh, the door beepers seem to echo a little bit more. That'll do. That's about right, isn't it? Off we go. And you can actually see, if we zoom in on the screen here, you can see from this bar here how much throttle I'm, or how much power I'm applying. So that's a good one, particularly with the joystick, because you're not clicking up like one press of the Q, two press of the Q, three press of the Q. This is more a, a kind of continuous power thing, so it's good to be able to keep your eye on that. There we go. Hello! Didn't wave back, quite rude. I don't reckon this is a tight bend, you know, I reckon we can we can do 50 around here. On t uh, granted we're on two wheels as we do so. But they don't pay for comfort, they pay to get from A to B very quickly. I can't help but thinking I should have stopped on that yellow marker. Oh well. No points for stopping there. So yeah, I mean, just having to think about it, there's so much that they could actually do with this simulator. I mean, a good one I don't think we'll see any UK, I could be wrong, but I don't think we'll see any UK based tram routes for, uh, for quite a while. Uh, I mean there's Berlin, Berlin has a hell of a tram system, you've got Prague trams, why are we indicating? Ah, because the indicator can be done from the joystick, brilliant, I did not know that. Uh, yeah, I think that, I mean, there's Berlin, there's Prague, there's more Vienna, there's different trams that we could have in Vienna if they're adding extra trams to the route. I mean, you've seen how many, like, crossings and points there are on this. We could have more routes in Vienna, that'd be nice. Uh, but yeah, this is an amazing platform for so much. I mean, I'd quite like to see Blackpool trams. That's a fairly simple route, it's just one route. Uh, you've also got, I mean, where else have we got? We've got Nottingham trams, Birmingham trams, uh, the Croydon trams in London, I think that'd be a popular one. And of course you've got um, uh, Manchester trams. A little bit more of a light rail than a tram system, but uh, but yeah, there's, there's lots you could do with this, and I'm quite excited for the future. Right, let's indicate out while we've got the, uh, while we've got the signal there. So these signals here with like the X's underneath would be telling me to stop, but I'm sure the X means uh, that it's like a, a marker for this signal, so that we kind of know what's coming up. It's what I've been using them as anyway. Um, maybe I've meant to stop at it, who knows, but it doesn't really make sense stopping back there when you could stop here. And of course, if anybody does actually know more you know, all these kind of questions that I've got, I'm kind of working it out for myself here, but if I am wrong, uh, please do let me know in the comments section. Off we go. 
Because I do like to learn, I like to do it right. What's the point of a simulator if you're not going to do it right? Nope, we're being undertaken here. Do we stop here? No, we'll, st we'll stop at the line. I feel a bit of an idiot for blocking the junction, but... We'll stop at this line here. That's where he's stopped anyway. I mean, what's that? What's that? An insignia? That nah, looks like an insignia, doesn't it? Any time today, don't you just hate these people that uh, press the button on the crossing and then uh, don't actually cross? Kids, probably. I just thought it was English kids that were yobs, but clearly the uh, the Austrian children are yobs as well. Pressing the uh, button on the crossing and then legging it off. How rude. Where's the dot? A bit further down at this one. There we go. And it appears that we're actually uh, we're on time still, but only just. We're not early now. Have a look what's happening down in the CCTV. You can just about see everybody's aboard. Door shut. Full power. I'm a little bit worried because I mean we're behind schedule. I don't want to start up. Oh, punctuality: 19 teaspoons. I'm assuming TSP stands for teaspoons. What else would it stand for? I'll give it the beans. Oh, hang on. We're, uh, we're going to have to slow down here. See if we can not actually stop. We're not going to be able to do it, are we? But I'd quite like to blast past these cars. Nope. I'm just hoping that uh, Cherie, down there in the Hyundai i10, isn't going to get any funny ideas and start trying to cut in front of me. Go on, turn right. Thank you. We're experiencing a little bit more lag today than, uh, than what we would usually. Uh, not quite far enough down today. Nine teaspoons. We'll go for the usual ten. That'll do. Right, off we go. I don't know what all the colours mean down here, because uh, we have red, blue and yellow, uh, but I know that when none of them are lit up, that means it's alright to go. Oh, horizontal with an X, so that can only mean we're stopping further down here. Come on. Come on, no, it's not going to happen, is it? You see, they're turning right, so... If they let us both go at the same time, who gives way to who? You would think that the car drivers would be expected to give way to the tram drivers, but, uh, again, in true OMSI fashion, <laughs> it's not always the case. Right, ah, right, okay, so they're going, and we're not. Clever, because I think we'd have had a crash there. Ready? Nope. Oh, it doesn't appear that we're going. Well, when's it our turn? Any time today. Ah, there we go. Right. Does feel a bit weird going against a red traffic light, I'm not going to lie. But uh, the little dots said that it was our turn to go. what you call a nice uh, no messing about quick stop there still only nine teaspoons should have gone a little bit further what does the yellow flashing triangle mean any guesses oh hang on we're in the plus that's no good quick door shut we need to go I mean the yellow triangles flashing there 
but then we've got this again this doesn't work with my theory of uh, oh hang on yes yeah, so that's the marker on the right there and then that's the actual signal we're following so we'll stop here so we're not blocking the road and uh, when they turn red we should be able to go there we go thank you dear I don't know if that classes as a tight corner or not. I imagine this does in front, so we'll, uh, we'll slow down. My apologies. Leaving my phone turned on in recording. How dare I? Right, okie dokie. So, are we... Uh, is, is this tight? I'd say that was a... Yeah, that's not a tight corner, is it? But we are crossing tracks, so we won't go too fast. So we're going to stop here, I'll have absolutely no points for this. The yellow dot is there. I don't know if you can see that. Um, so, I mean, if we stopped with the tram there, you can just see it there, we, surely we'd be way past the stop. But there we go. Oh, we're a minute late. Yeah, so uh, I, don't, I don't quite know what's going on at that stop. We'll keep to 25. Thought they weren't stopping for a second there. Keep to around 25, and uh, we'll have to keep to 25 down here because there's some more crossings. Staying on the uh, on the forward there. Oh, and uh, that's our cue to stop. We'll just block the road. Do we... No, we stick with the dots. Right, okie dokie. We'll indicate left, because we are in fact going left. I, I'd say that this was a fairly tight corner, so we'll, uh, we'll stick to a cheeky little 15 round here. There's always one in a Tesla, isn't there? Doing the bit for the environment. I don't know. If you really wanted to do your bit for environment, uh, for the environment, mate, you'd hop aboard my tram. A damn sight eco-friendly, uh, more eco-friendly than your Tesla any day. There we go. Give it the beans. We are late after all. Get rid of that dot out the centre of the screen. You see, I'm, I'm losing it. We were doing so well with the stopping distances at first, and, and now I'm, uh, I'm getting shaken. Come on, door shut. I don't care if you've not finished boarding. It's time to go. We're late, and the traffic lights are on green. Off. Well, they're not. They're on two dots. They're on vertical. That's not a sharp corner. Not at all. Is can we go? Yep, yeah, vertical dots, right, okay, okay. What is with this lag today? It's not normally this bad. Right, yeah, let's uh, let's give them a run for the money. We can't we we can't even see out here, we've got no wing mirrors or anything. And uh, this is quite a tight corner around the top, so we'll uh, we'll slow down. Is it a 15 miles? Not 15 miles an hour. Yeah, I think this is a 15 kilometer an hour. -er. One thing that I have noticed as well is we uh, we have like these buttons for, for wheelchairs, or for wheelchair ramps there, and uh, but we don't seem to have any wheelchair passengers, which is a bit of an odd one. Right, come on, 
Boarding has commenced. Well, I I'm sorry, but uh, but the doors are shut, my love. You should have got on quicker. Cheerio. Some nice, uh, what's that? City hall, maybe? Makes nice. That must be the rat house. That's on uh, vertical lights there. Hello, colleague. Oh, hang on. 25 mile an hour over the junction. Uh, kilometers an hour. I can't get used to this kilometers an hour, I tell you. There's, there's a stop here. Where do we stop? Anywhere. Anywhere at all? Are we going past it? Yep, it appears so. Ah, there we go. Dot. See, I would argue we've gone... Oh, hang on. This this could be the rat house. I mean, to be fair, this looks more like a museum. Do we reckon that's a museum? I could actually read the, uh, the, the things that come with this, and I'd be able to tell you. Yeah, right. Doors are shut. Doors are not shut. Doors are shut now. Nope. There we go. Very nice. Do you know what? The, the graphics on this are fantastic. You can tell it's been done in the Unreal Engine. But, um, yeah, absolutely brilliant. I'm developing a bit of a love for this game. Parliament. Another stop. Oh, Parliament. Zwei. Sorry, Richtung Parliament. Dornbach. Very nice. Well, that answers the question as to what that building is. I mean, some of our politicians are so old, I guess they do belong in a museum, so maybe it is a museum. If they're anything like us. Right, get the doors shut. Oh, dear me, that's, that's another woman that's missed it there. Oh, she's disappeared. Let's, uh, let's get a bit of a head start on uh, Tommy Tesla here. Nope. They're, they're going to make us stop, aren't they? Well, of course he's going to win. He's faster than us. Oh. A. Off we go. Nope. Can we? Ah, vertical now. There's a delay. Well, that's no good. We're behind now. Got catching up to do. Don't you dare turn right. Ah, hang on. Rathausplatz. So this must be where the city hall is. I had uh, an LGBT crossing, I'm assuming that is. Oh, is this where those Austrian horses refused to go across that crossing because they didn't like the colours and uh, there was outcry about homophobic horses? You've never heard anything so daft in all your days, have you? But uh, yeah, there, there was some sort of news article uh, where the horses wouldn't go across the crossing. Oh. Ah, that's excellent. The trigger on the joystick is set up for the, uh, for the, for the bell. Brilliant. You know, you see, we're all discovering together. This just gets better and better. This game, especially when you're using the joystick. I mean, it is a little bit odd because I've got it set up on the left of me, which is a right-handed joystick, so it's not particularly comfortable to hold. But I thought, well, with the with the the doofer been down there, we we want it to be real, don't we? You can change for a lot from here. You wouldn't think so, would you? It's just a, a standard tram stop. And we seem to be back on time. Excellent, that's what we like. A lot of beeping going on. Can't see much in the in the way of the old CCTV. 
Uh, are you getting on, love? Are you not? Because when that goes to vertical, where are we going? In fact, you know what? We're, we're shutting the doors now in preparation. Because I have a feeling that any minute now. There we go, you see? No time for dilly dallying. And the punctuality points are going up. So, uh. Should really have tooted the old uh, ringy ringer. There we go. Are we stopping again? Yeah, that's one thing I've noticed about Vienna. There are too many traffic lights and too many tram signals. I can't help but feeling if they got rid of them all, we will get there a lot quicker. In your own time. No, I guess we were a little bit early there. Uh, you can normally coordinate it with the traffic lights, so if we keep an eye on what they're doing. Right, so if we get ready, there we go. And uh, the, the Seat, who's very carelessly stuck his badge on the wrong way around, uh, is absolutely trouncing us. Oop, that was a triangle. And that, oh hang on, no, the dot's there. Everybody feeling alright? We're not travel sick? We're feeling alright in the back? Oh my god, there's people coming through the ceiling. What have you been doing up there? There's pantographs up there and... Oh god, those dungarees. That's quite a fashion statement, my love. How bizarre. Uh, yeah, the... Um, I've, I've forgotten what I was going to say then. Those dungarees just completely threw me. Now where are we going here? Do we do we go left? Do we go forward? I'm gonna well it says left on there, but I think we go forward from doing this before. Or maybe it means forward and left, who knows? Well, we're doing it. Here we go, so, oh, hang on, we, we can, no, nope, we've got to stop, damn it. That was quite an abrupt stop. Almost caused Esmeralda down there to drop a coffee. Wouldn't it be a shame if she spilt coffee all over those wonderful dungarees? Oof, gives me shudders at the thought of it. Come on, we're not interacting with anything here, we, we can literally, we can go. There's nothing coming. There's, we don't even cross a road. I don't know. I'm putting lights in for the sake of it. Off we go. And uh, sharp corner, would you say? We'll uh, we'll we'll treat it as a sharp corner, just in case. You never know when a member of management might be watching. Get out of the way! What are you doing? Got a death wish? Where's that yellow dot? Sometimes... Oh, there it is. Whoa, we're going past it. Sometimes it can be quite difficult to work out which... Where, where the actual stop is. There's like a stop that goes on for like 20 metres. Maybe even longer. Like a 100 metre stop. And you're like, well, at what point am I meant to stop here? Yep, yeah, time to go. Door's shutting. Well, why aren't you getting on? Oh, you've missed it now, you see. Walk away. This looks like a section we're going to get some speed up. I mean, we're late, so fingers crossed we'll be able to uh, catch some of that time up. Fantastic. Who doesn't love blasting through the city centre on a tram? Oh, this is the airport bit. Is it? Connections to airport bus. There you go, you see. 
You can tell I've done this before. We're late, come on, jump on. We want to make these traffic lights. Well, we're indicating out, so I think we've committed. There we go, we have committed to that, we're going. It was still half a minute late. How does that happen? I'm literally driving like a bat out of hell. And we're still... Uh, we better slow down for the corner. I reckon 25 will be enough for this corner. I wouldn't say it was particularly... I mean, if, if we had some speed limit signs, we'd know. But, uh, yeah, 25 kilometres an hour, sorry. But we're not getting used to this, are we? At all. There we go, that's on... Uh, that's on go, so let's get through it while it's on go. Oh, junction. Forgot about that one. Oh well, we'll, we'll remember for that one. Are you, are you just going, son? What are you doing? Idiot. God, I don't know. Well, it's nice to know that the Europeans are as idiotic as some of the... So, bleh, can't even speak. That uh, our European cousins are as completely moronic as, uh, as the English tend to be. I mean, the amount of people in Manchester I've seen now, they've been mowed down by one of the flexities. Unreal. I mean, there's too many people anyway in Manchester, isn't it? Surely it wouldn't hurt for one or two of them to just get mowed down. Just keep the numbers down. Off we go. Hey, I don't know. It's always the same, isn't it? They make you stop and then change. Quick, we need to get through the next set. We can get some uh, get some power down here. No signals on that one. Hang on. Oh, are we forward and? Well, well, what do we? Oh, hang on. There we go. Forward. Forgotten about it again. Now ah, we're back on time. We're early. Fantastic. You see a, a little bit of. Putting the hammer down, and uh, and we're back on time. That's what we like. Can't stand being late. Well, it's all right on the train if you're late, because when you're dispatching from each station, you don't have to check your watch. Makes it just that little bit easier. But uh, no on games, because you normally get told off, don't you? I, I don't know if you get told off on this when you're late, but on OMSI, they're uh, they're real snotty with you. Hintere Zollamtstraße. Umsteigen zu O. In Richtung Raxstraße. There we go. Ah, we're back a minute early. Sensational. It's what we like. Got a half a minute, that's as good as. Now I reckon we go straight on here, because we've got our, uh, our good friend the city. You see, there's a 50. I'm assuming that means kilometres an hour. Come on, doors are shutting now, we need to stay on time. I'll just crawl up to the traffic lights. Are you flashing because you're going to stop? You watch it, or wait for us to stop. Come on! Nope. 
Oh, there you go. Ah, there we go. So, so I'm, I'm in a way. I feel like I'm waiting for. Oh, there we go. Right. Okay. Okay. Forwards and right. I'm gonna say I kind of felt like I was meant to do something there, but obviously not. Ah, remember the 25 kilometer an hour rule that time. And same again here. Radetzky Platz. Umsteigen zu O in Richtung Praterstern. I do like the clunk to clunk as you go over the points. It's uh, that that's a good one. I like that. And the movement in the tram is simulated quite well. Rightio, so I'm guessing that we're under the traffic lights here. Because I mean we've we've got that signal there, but I feel a bit... There we go. Right, three, door shut. Indicate left, because we're pulling off, and then right, because we're going round to the right here, I think. Yes, we are. I've never got 20 for the punctuality. I only ever seem to get 19. Perhaps I'm just no good. But I've never got 20. Hello! Should we? Are these two just going to walk out in front of us? Nope, they're going to stay on the pavement. Good on you, lads. Nope, what was that? Are we all on? Yep, that's about right, isn't it? No point waiting. See, I don't want someone to just pop out from one of these junctions. I don't think ringing the bell has any effect as to whether they will just drive out in front of you or not, but I feel like it does, so, you know, it's just kind of a self-satisfaction sort of thing. I feel in real life that's what they would do, to kind of warn you that there's going to be a flying, a fast, whizzing tram about to come past. Are we aboard? Come on, chaps, chop chop. We want to make the lights. And sharp corner, back down. Ah, oh, no, this is a sharp corner. This is well worthy of 15 kilometres an hour, isn't it? Can't help but feel that we're, uh, we're almost at the end of the route. I seem to remember this bridge with the weird bus lanes and taxi lanes all whizzing across in front of each other, like there. I mean, what what does that mean? And again, white line across. I was always told not to cut a solid white line, but in the tram you don't really have much of an option, do you? One of my uh, particular favourite middle of the road tram stops. So we basically stop here. And uh, if we flick, you see that they have to just, I mean, anybody could be coming down here and mowing them down. And I've not had it yet on this game. It's, uh, this road never seems to have any traffic on. But in real life, apparently it is, like, the dumb thing that you have to stop. If a tram pulls in here, you have to stop. And you can't undertake. Quite sensible, really, because you'd mow all the passengers down, wouldn't you? Health and safety and all that. Stick to 35 round here, that seems like a, an acceptable speed. 
Prater Hauptallee. Oh, Prater Hauptallee. Auf Wiedersehen. Auf Wiedersehen. That can only mean goodbye. So I'm guessing that this is the uh, this is the quick bit of the route down to the terminus, which is bringing us to the end of today's video. So I do hope that you enjoyed the uh, the full run of the Route One in Vienna. Uh, I've certainly enjoyed driving it. I hope you enjoyed uh, coming along for the ride. Do, as I say, do consider subscribing. Uh, there will be a button in the middle of the screen, or at the bottom in the middle of the screen, to uh, allow you to do that shortly when YouTube decides to pop it there. There's also a link to the playlist of Tram Sim, so you can get all your Tram Simmy goodness in there. And then on the left hand side, uh, you will see a video that YouTube has recommended for you uh, based on your what you like. So if it's a lot of nonsense and you think why on earth would I want to see that, uh, don't blame me, blame YouTube. And so there we are at, uh, oh the destination's changed for going back already, sensational. Uh, well we're not going to do that today, we might do that another time. Uh, but yes, thank you for watching and I shall see you next time, goodbye for now.